Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Gino Choi from Newton International High School. Today, I'd like to present my role model. Before starting, let me show you a picture. From this map, we can notice in eight countries, more than 50% of adolescents are not in school. And those areas are concentrated in certain districts, such as Africa, Central America, and Asia. So, the global issue I want to talk about is the inequality of educational opportunity. Do you know what causes such an inequality? No. Economic status, gender, race, ability or disability may be causes of it. Actually, governments and civil organizations have always been trying to eliminate it. Nevertheless, it still exists today. My role model, Jonathan Coder, is one of those who tried to eliminate such an inequality. He was born in Boston in 1936 and graduated from Harvard University. He is an American activist, educator, and writer. All of all, he is best known for publishing many books regarding educational inequality. One of his most famous books is Savage Inequalities. It clearly shows education in strong areas and the problem of public education. In addition to this book, he published numerous books, including On Being a Teacher, which emphasized compassion to the poor, and Letters to a Young Teacher, which are the letters of a young teacher in low-income area. Also, he founded a non-profit non organiza organization called Cambridge Institute for Public Education. It is dedicated to helping create an equitable and enlightened model of public education for a democratic nation. He also founded Education Action, aiming to mobilize teachers into a move, national movement that makes, makes their voice, voices uh, makes their voices reflected in the police arena. Then, why I chose him as my role model? Why Jonathan Coder? Because I want to give first students many opportunities in the future in my career. I'd like to uh, I'd like to establish charity, financially helping for the children, and I'd like to hold public campaign striving for equitable education. Thank you for this.